Hello everybody and welcome back to Gotham Lounge. My name is Joe, and today we're back with some more Death Stranding. Alright, we're getting ready to take on another order. So we were successfully able to make the first delivery over to the engineer. And now we got the next order, which... What we're gonna do is we're actually gonna go over to the craftsman this time. He actually has the heaviest of the two loads and actually the most potential likes. So we're gonna be delivering uh, gun pods and anti-BT weapon deliver. Yep, yeah, anti-BT weapons. So let's go ahead and uh, listen to the briefing real quick. You'll be handing this one off to a guy we call the craftsman. Repairs, modifications, you name it, he can do it. Makes weapons too. Nothing lethal on account of his pacifism. In fact, if you give him something lethal, he'll turn it into something that isn't. A tool designed purely for self-defense. That's what the gun parts listed in the order are for. Make sure they get to him and no one else. Guns make bodies, and bodies make craters. While you're at it, I'd also like you to transport some blood bags and hematic grenades. You know, the ones you feel tested against BTs and delivered to Lake Knot City. He'd like to dole them out to the local porters. We've got no reason to keep them to ourselves, so I figured we may as well oblige him. All right, that seems fair enough. And select that. Hey, we're okay as far as fabricating anything. Oh boy, this is gonna weigh a crap ton. But, thankfully, oh uh, yeah, thankfully we got at least more boots, we have a lot of things at our disposal. Alright, let's go ahead and make our way out there. He's already almost falling over. Oh god, the thing's just about to haul as he is. Alright. Here we go. Off to have a pleasant journey. Craftsman. The boots I'm wearing right now are actually up to wear out. It's the easiest way to get there. Ah! I'm do my best. Alright, let's see. Hmm. Actually, it looks like there's a ladder already down over there, so let's go there. And I could, and it actually looks like there's several more ladders laid down. Kind of don't want to go in this area if I can avoid it. Because of the, uh, mule activity. I mean, what I did do off camera, I don't know if they were... Oh, I can't go that way? Alright, I have to go through. I have to go out this direction. Still can't go that way. Barry. Okay. Have a pleasant journey. Thank God, BB looks happy. Let me go that direction. Weapons Have you restrictions just lifted? Okay, let's back to the map for a second. Remove all markers. Can we go over there from where we're standing? I 
doesn't look like we're gonna be held back, so that's good. Man, the ragdoll effects in this game are pretty, uh, <laughs> kind of similar to how Red Dead was. Very realistic. <laughs> Slight loss of balance and forget it, it's like pretty much game over. I am being the overachiever, as usual. Now these terrains are going to be pretty tough, because there's a lot of... We've already encountered already. We've had BT... Not BTs. Uh, mules. We've had rocky terrains like this. We've had rivers, creeks, and you name it. I can only imagine what it's going to look like once uh, the map really starts to expand. So far, so good. There's the ladder. Keep it up. Keep it up. Nothing else appears to be dropped, so we're just gonna make our way towards that ladder. Blind three. Thank you for this ladder. This is a lifesaver. Oh, let's try not to fall. Let's go slow. Thanks for the help. You. Major help. All right. Hmm. Now, where to go from here? Actually, we could make our way... Actually, it looks like some ladders are already set up. Save for what's over here. Alright, uh, let's make our way towards... Climbing Anchor. We may have to actually pull our way across. Ooh, those strands off in the distance. Doesn't look too promising. What do we got here? This is like really standing out. Heck up. Oh. Just more of those cryptic bios. starting to, again, wear thin. I'm pretty sure walking over these, uh, rocky terrains is not helping matters too much. But I have multiple other pairs. Even you can see them attached to the plaza. until they're completely ruined. Get the most use out of them. Okay. Alright, 
you did it. Alright, thank you. He's a good guy. Can't pronounce your name, I'm sorry. But, we're gonna use you to get across. Spot. Perfect. Thank you. Oh, I hope this isn't BT land. Alright, let's head to the ladder next. Okay, running's not a good idea. <laughs> right, I'm gonna take this. Nice. Oh, the lad is going up this rock. All right, thank you, Storm Insider, for this ladder. Thanks for the help. Yeah, I see some strands up in the sky. That's a little concerning. Oh. Maybe coming up here wasn't a good idea. <laughs> Oh, God! Ugh. All right, hold on, the baby. Literally lost everything. Yeah, I fell down. That was baby's pissed. Get. I'll check on BB. All right. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's okay. All right. All right. Seems to be fine now. look terrible. I think what I can do I can go across to, I'm gonna go across this way. Storm Insider, this thank you again. Me. What I'm thinking is we could probably go across to the river right here and I'll set up a uh, hold on, how much further do we have? Actually, you know what? Let's go a little further along the line. So another thing I could do. If I get close enough to where the craftsman is, I can lay a ladder down, one of my own. Actually, you know what? Is my ladder. I think this will work. Perfect. Okay. There we go. Uh, okay. All right. 
awesome. Let's, uh, we should be able to make it over there now, no problem. Alright, so we'll just stay along. Grab this pyro crystal. There we go. Never have too many of these, I'm learning. Just rain, nothing else. I haven't seen any other activities. Maybe not too much. My, my boots are about to give out. Thankfully, the location is right there. Craftsman, all right, we're here. Weapon usage restricted. Okay. Express ID verified. Weapons detected. All weapons will be locked until departure. Cargo verified. Well, how it suddenly stopped raining when I approached the property. Kilograms off me, finally. Delivering cargo. You're not with Fragile Express, are you? Nope. Oh, I get it. Bridget is using their IDs to complete the delivery. Well, good work, son. Thank you. I'll take that off your hands. Package looks. brand new. Wow. Since I've seen cargo in such good shape. Thank you kindly. I know it couldn't have been easy. Yeah, I took a tumble off a ledge. I literally was using every online piece of help as best I could. Ladders, climbing anchors, you name it. S for awesome! Wow, not a lot of likes from this guy. Even though I did bring it over to him. Great. I've been aboard the title of Mover. As a proven porter, you 
Many now turn to you for assistance. Nice. You've achieved bridge link grade number 10. You can now make strand contracts with other players. You can now upgrade cooperation requests in order to ask other players to contribute materials to your structures. The period which you can send likes has been increased to five seconds. Sweet. What's your angle anyway? Everyone knows Fragile was behind the attack that wiped out Middlemont City. Only a damn fool trusts that terrorist to deliver shit now. But here you are, filling in. Keeping her business alive for her, am I right? <laughs> I swear. Can't trust anyone these days. And don't try sweet-talking me onto your little network. You know why there's been so many terrorist attacks recently? Because you all pissed them off with your talk of reuniting the country. Join the ECA. I may as well paint a bullseye on my shelter. Just keep my deliveries coming. We'll get along just fine. I don't need any trouble. Though I will say, I appreciate these hematic grenades of yours. Quality work, gotta admit. Not the sort of equipment the UCA ought to keep to itself. There's a lot of freelance porters operating in these parts, after all. If I could churn these out by the boatload and gear up those folks, now you're good people. I can see that. And you brought my order like I asked. But it'll take more than that for me to agree to what you're asking. Chiral Network is a big step. But if you could prove to me Bridges is an organization I can trust, hmm. well, how about this? Do another run for me. I'll put the details on the terminal there. Good work. New order available. Please access delivery terminal for further You're not pleased with us, and then you're asking me to do a favor for you? Okay. Alright, what do you got for me? Not far from Middle Knot City, you'll find the ruins of an old shopping mall. They predate the Death Stranding. The craftsmen used to live there. Until terrorists organized a void out or two and BTs started showing up. Needless to say, the craftsmen had to move house in a hurry. Grabbed what little he could and left most everything else behind. Which is where you come in. He wants you to go and get his old toolkit and bring it back to the shelter. His old home's locked up tight, but he'll open it remotely for you when you set out. The place is crawling with BTs, though. No one in their right mind would even try to pull this off. But if you can, then the old man might finally realize Bridges is only trying to help. All right. So in order to get on his good side, we need to bring back a toolbox. All right. I'm going to go ahead and uh, accept this agreement. The toolkit you're looking for ought to be in my old shelter. It's been tagged, so... Shouldn't have any trouble finding the place. I'll unlock it remotely once you get there. Oh, and take some of those hematic grenades you brought with you. Nothing you'll want more when those BTs put your back against the wall, right? Here's hoping it won't come to that. All right, I'll take that. Attached to the suit for now, because my current boots are going to. I'll put on my right hip. Uh, let's see. Turn the head out. I think, actually, just to be safe. Order assigned. Oh, never mind. Shoot. Oh, I have a container repair spray. Okay, never mind. I want to make sure I have one just in case because... Yeah, I want to make sure I had a container repair spray because if they said that this place where I have to retrieve this toolkit is filled with BTs, I want to make sure I have at least 
one spray if I get caught in a void out. But, uh, yep, in the next episode, we're gonna go retrieve his toolkit and bring it back and hope that he'll actually, uh, align with Bridges. So on that note, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end the episode right here. So thank you guys very much for tuning in today for this episode of Death Stranding here on Gotham Lounge. If you guys enjoyed the video, please go ahead and leave a thumbs up on the video and feel free to leave a comment down below as always. If you'd like to continue <laughs> staying in touch with us, watching future videos or videos of our past, just go ahead and hit the subscribe button on the lower right-hand corner of the screen and you'll get a bell notification every time I upload a brand new video. So once again, guys, Thank you very much for tuning in today for this episode of Death Stranding here on Gotham Lounge. And you guys have a fantastic day.